covered in more detail in another video, Jamil's references to himself being Colum's servant have generally been removed from the English language version of the game. In the English language game, Colum references hoverboards as if they are an established technology in the Twisted Wonderland universe. In the original game, however, Colum does not seem to know what hoverboards are, and refers to them as flying skateboards. This may imply that Colum is unfamiliar with the concept of hoverboards and they may be special Stooks technology, rather than something with which everyone is familiar. <laughs> A small point, but on En Rook explains his unique magic as something that allows him to envision things, up until he actually uses it, when he suddenly exclaims, I see it. In his original dialogue, the word he uses remains consistent, instead of changing back and forth. This word might, however, not exist in English. In Japanese there are multiple different ways to describe the word see, depending upon how you are looking at something. To simply perceive something with your eyes we use one kanji, with another kanji to view something as a spectator, and a third kanji for when you are focusing in on something specific. All three are pronounced, miru. The kanji Rook uses is the third option. So he is not saying that he is merely able to perceive something with his eyes, or able to watch something unfolding in front of him, he's saying that he is able to focus upon something specific. Since English is more limited, the English language adaptation chose to shift between the words see and envision to try and get the same concept across. In the original game Appel comments that Rook's magic is particularly scary when he thinks about such a power being in Rook's hands, but his commentary about Rook was removed from the English language game. <laughs> Leona is the only character of the five abductees who is able to instantly recognize when he awakes in a simulation. That makes this a rather significant change to Riddle's dialogue, he originally expresses confusion about what it was they had been doing, but in his English language dialogue he sounds like he is still aware that Idia and Ortho are working behind the scenes, when he isn't. <laughs> The English language adaptation removed references to most of the NRC students still being minors. Bill saying that he and Idia are still 18. And the fact that they are all students, which are all normal changes for EN. Interestingly, Bill's line at the end of the game about still being 18 was preserved, despite being removed earlier on. In a beautiful use of furigana, our introduction to the child formerly known as Ortho is with Robot Ortho and Dead Ortho simultaneously saying, Pleasure to make your acquaintance, me. The kanji used is Boku for I or me, but both characters pronounce it as Ortho. This actually happened earlier in the game as well, perhaps as foreshadowing, but could not be carried over to EN due to language limitations. As the English language has no furigana equivalent, the English language adaptation went with just ortho, instead. Furigana and the way Twist uses it for wordplay has been covered in more detail in a separate video. While Idia seems to have programmed Robot Ortho to refer to him as Nissan, the original Ortho would call him Nichan. Hi, Nita. Nita. Neither of these words technically exist in English, so Robot Ortho has been calling Idia by his name on EN, which suits its English-speaking audience. When original Ortho appears, however, Idia realizes who it is without him needing to identify himself, which meant that Ian's original ortho had to refer to him as something different than their robot ortho, and they settled on idiot. 
In the scene where Idia reveals he is going to support original Ortho's plans he originally adopts the name that Ortho uses for him, Nichan. If En wanted to follow JP's continuity, Idia would have had to refer to himself as Idia, like En's original Ortho, but he doesn't. Instead, Ian Idia refers to himself as Big Bro, despite how neither Ortho ever refers to him in that way in the English language game. So while the original game has two names for Idiot depending upon which Ortho is speaking, it seems that Ian has three, Robot Ortho's Idia, Original Ortho's nickname and Idia's way of referring to himself in relation to Original Ortho, Big Bro. This comes up again during Fairy Gala if, where Idia originally refers to himself as JP Ortho's Nichan but on EN he refers to himself as Big Bro, instead of EN Ortho's nickname for him. And Idia referring to himself as Original Ortho's name for him is not a secret from Robot Ortho. Idia refers to himself as Nichan in a conversation with Ortho that we see in Book 5, which serves as a direct parallel to Idia's identical line in Book 6. After original Ortho dies for the second time, he shifts from Nichan to Robot Ortho's Nissan to pass the torch. Since Robot Ortho only ever refers to Idia by his name on Ian, that is what this becomes, but this means that Ian misses out on a significant moment later on. At the very end of Book 6, Idia tells Robot Ortho that he has formed a mind of his own. This was translated as heart on Ian, but the original word, Kokoro, is a different concept than the English words heart and mind and is kind of a combination of the two. Idia tells Robot Ortho that he no longer needs to play the part of Ortho for him anymore. Dismissed from his role, we see Ortho do something he has never done before. He refers to Idia by his full name, even calling him Idia-san, as in that moment, they are no longer siblings. Idia agrees to allow Robot Ortho to be his real little brother, and Ortho immediately returns to using Nissan again. This moment was not, and maybe just couldn't be, included on Ian, with Ortho referring to Idia in the same way he always does, throughout the entire conversation. This might be interesting to people studying English, the localization of the game often translates the gender neutral you all to boys, sometimes even adding it to sentences where no one is saying you all at all. Gender specific terms like sir and ma'am also get added to sentences where, originally, the characters are referring to each other by gender neutral words like their job titles. Originally Azul says, no matter how many hearts I have, it will never be enough, as octopi have three hearts. This octopus-based joke was removed from the English language game. There is a fan theory that octopi having three hearts is the reason that Jade and Floyd both have the word heart in the names of their unique magics. In Rook's original dialogue, he follows up Vil's praise of Appel's accuracy with his magic by saying, speaking of spell drive, I'm told that even Leona Kuhn holds Appel Kuhn's flying prowess in high regard. This is a reference to an earlier conversation in Book 6, where Epel himself tells Rook that Leona has said that he is the best first-year flyer in the Spell Drive Club. There seems to have been some confusion on Ian, however, and Rook's line was mistranslated as, I'm told that Epel's flying prowess is even greater than Leona's, which is not what he was told at all. Kind of pedantic, 
but in Leona's original dialogue he is saying that there is still hope for Jamil, though there is no hope for him. Jamil finally understands this later on, realizing that Leona has been trying to teach him that he still has potential, even if things may look bleak at the moment. <laughs> Leona's line of, after all, you're not like me, was, however, written backwards in the English language of the game into, after all, I'm not like you, making Leona the subject of the sentence, instead. Covered in more detail in another video, Azul confessing his past issues with food to riddle was removed from the English language game. While the English language adaptation kept Ace's line where he insults the prefect, Deuce's insult was removed. Ruggie makes a hilariously timed compliment about Leona having absurdly long legs in his original dialogue, which the English language translation changed into Leona being annoyingly tall. It is neat to see this comment kind of make it into the EN server at all, as, usually when a character comments on Leona or Vil having long legs, it is removed. In one of the final scenes of Book 6, Idia is explaining what happened to Robot Ortho. In Ortho's original dialogue he says, he, in quotation marks, when referring to dead Ortho, refusing to call him by his name. In the English adaptation this was changed to Ortho saying, original Ortho, instead. 